What's good, YouTube? Vacasa Kavi here. So, we got a request from Way. This is O55. It's called On the Prow. I'm excited to check out an artist that we haven't really done much of for you guys. You guys have a lot of artists that we haven't even gotten into yet. So, we're going to check out some O55 for you with this one. Way. Thank you for your request. I appreciate you, my friend. If you guys are new here, go ahead and subscribe for me. We talk about mental health, addiction, world issues, everything in between. Break down all the lyrics, instrumentation. I believe we got a music video again for this one. So, I'm very excited for another new artist that we haven't done much of. Thank you again, Way. If you guys struggle with mental health and addiction, go get yourself some professional help. Listen to the advice, build yourself back up, find new hobbies, find better ways and more productive ways to pass your time. Go inspire some people, share your journey, be willing to help other people out with what they are going through when they're going through the same thing. If they ever need someone to talk to, you have a hell of a lot of advice from your own experience and you can really save a lot of lives just by telling your own story and letting people know that they are not alone inside of those struggles and that's what I like to do when I get on here and we talk about the things that a lot of these songs are about. We get a lot of songs on here that are about mental health and about addiction and stuff and we really get to dive in and talk about it when we break these lyrics down so we'll see what we get with this one. I think this one might be more of a fun song like an anthem kind of song so we'll see. It's got a like a old car and it says take it greasy is what the album is called yeah take it greasy so the, yeah this is like some fun time music i do believe so we'll see way thank you again for the request i appreciate you guys tuning in we're gonna get into it on bakasa coffee a reaction video a day or two keep the doctor away fuck those apples this is all 55 with on the prowl Mmm, classic sounding. Waiting, and it's a Saturday night. Okay. And I call up the boys, who will be cruising tonight. They got a party on, and they say it's gonna be alright. Well, we park the custard on somebody's front lawn. And the boys and I, we sneak in the back door. This is vintage, dude. Even the video, the video, the like quality of the video and the, even their outfits and everything. Really awesome right here. This is freaking cool. I love the vibe. I love how classic it is. This reminds me of stuff I listened to when I was a kid. Just the vibe of it. Very classic sound here. It says, well, I've been waiting and it's a Saturday night. I call up the boys. We'll be cruising tonight. They got a party on, and they say it's going to be all right. Hell yeah. That was my entire teenage years. <laughs> and many of the years after it. <laughs> many of the years after as well. He said, well, we parked the Custer on somebody's front lawn, and the boys and I, we sneak in the back door, he says. We mingle in like we've done it a million times before. Damn. They sneaking now. They going sneaking. <laughs> sneaking through the back door, they said. We mingle in like we've done it a million times before. I like the way that they said that. I love this video. The video has such a classic vibe. That's how we get out of I'm the proud. Don't you tell my mom. saying we are out on the town and we are up to no good this time right he says on the prowl that's how we get our fun on the prowl don't you tell my mom on the prowl how the company you keep on the prowl you know it ain't so discreet prowling with the boys on a saturday night he says they're just looking for trouble they're just 
looking around for anything and then everything, right? Yeah. Those were some of the best times of my life were having not a single plan of what was about to happen, but getting in a car with some people, group of people, group of friends, and wherever the hell you end up that day is where it is. <laughs> some of my best memories, man, for real. I like this song. I love the vibe of it. Oh no, no, you don't want that. Uh uh. You done messed up now, buddy. <laughs> he said, Well, all was quiet till we turned off the lights, and I heard some shouting, someone started the fight, and I struck a match. I nearly died of fright, he says. He says, you Know what I saw? Good golly grief. I was looking at the police chief. You done goofed. <laughs> They got themselves busted out, running her muck, right? Now, now they're going to get in trouble. Mom's going to find out now. You looking at the police chief? You in trouble? <sighs> I got brought home by the police a few times whenever I was a kid. <laughs> Sometimes I was in my own neighborhood one of the times. I got into an argument with a neighbor. Police showed up. Yep, that was one time. Another time was for a different reason. I got put on probation for that time. <laughs> yeah. Be like that sometimes, man. But yep, they got themselves busted by the police chief now. So can you imagine striking a match and the police chief is just right there like a fucking movie scene? Fucking scare you right out of your skin if you're up to no good, which they clearly are not in this song. He's already told you he don't even want nobody to know what they're up to. They gotta keep it discreet. He can't even tell people who he's with, right? <laughs> you gotta love it. the police man's ball he says he says on the prowl now i've seen it all on the prowl the police man's ball <laughs> on the prowl and they were everywhere on the prowl so i ran for the stairs prowling with the boys on a saturday night these are great lyrics really awesome i love the way this is written i like that the chorus also is different both times around to continue the story onwards and we still have more lyrics to go. I like this. This is a really good song. I like the storytelling. There's good humor and stuff in it, too. I like that. This song is a social documentary on the human habit of congregating in the safety of numbers. Okay. The lights came on, but we were gone. Yeah. I made it to the door at half the speed of light Got to my car, I nearly died There was a policeman sitting smiling inside I'm the prowl I did <laughs> This is fucking great This is great right here, I love it Fucking awesome Beautiful songwriting The bridge here says this song is a social documentary on the human habitat of congregating in the safety of numbers. Yeah. There you go. Hey, yeah, safety and numbers, that's fucking facts right there, man. If anything pops off, there's always going to be someone there to have your back. It could be the person you least expect, but if there's a whole fucking big group of people, you'd be surprised who might save your ass. I know I've had experiences like that before in social settings. You would be really surprised who would be the one to show up and have your back in a group setting, right? And that's important, having that community and that togetherness to where even if something pops off, everybody knows that 
a situation will be handled and it can be resolved safely because everybody will stand with numbers and not let anything go awry, right? And that's the safety of numbers and human habitat of congregating, as he calls it. I love it. So the lights came on, but we were gone. I made it to the door at half the speed of light. Got to my car. He says, I nearly died. There was a policeman sitting smiling inside. <laughs> I love the way it's written. It's just so, it's so uncanny. It really is. Very, like, fucking slapstick kind of essence to the humor in it. I love it. It's fucking hilarious. Know what to say. I'm a proud. You know, crime does not pay. I'm a proud. I knew yeah. I was done. I'm a proud. Done goof. the police siren and everything in there i love the vibe of this video i really do i'll pull it back a little bit because so i like this chorus and i like the video we'll bring that back a bit so this last chorus says i didn't know what to say on the prowl i didn't know what to say on the prowl you know crime does not pay on the prowl i knew i was done he says on the prowl because he was wearing a gun prowling with the boys on a saturday night he says on the prowl, all the boys had gone on the prowl. They left me all alone. On the prowl, towed away my car. On the prowl, I should have stayed at home. Prowl with the boys on a Saturday night. He says, I done lost my car. My boys bailed on me. There's no, I don't have nobody here. They left so they didn't get in trouble. I'm stuck here with this smiling ass policeman. He says, <laughs> <laughs> the storytelling in this is fucking epic. The, it's really creative. It's very creative. He says, I lost my car, and cops sitting in there were smiling at me, wearing a gun. There's no safety in numbers now, <laughs> right? He says, <laughs> I love the storytelling, how it goes from zero to 100 really quickly. So like first they're adventuring, they're looking for a little bit of trouble, breaking the log, you know, keeping it discreet, mom and dad can't find out, and then next thing they know, they're running from the whole, whole policeman's ball, as he described it, I love it, this is one of the funnest things that we've done, way, thank you for requesting this, I like this one. On a Saturday night. In trouble. Got himself in trouble. That dialogue at the end. Telling the cop I don't have a license. The cop says, don't give me that bull. He says, I've left it at home. He says, show us your license. I saw you in there, kid, and you were with the rest of them. Guess to get in, you had to have your license or your ID with you, right? So the cop's like, I know you'd be fucking lying to me because you needed it to get in. Silly. That's what the cop says. I like that dialogue. Hold on. Let's bring this back real quick. If I can get this to rewind, listen to the dialogue again because I liked that. Alright, kid, uh, just okay. show us your license. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, don't give me any of that. Bullpen. No, I'm not doing that. Show us your license. I saw you in there, kid, and you were with the rest of us. <laughs> the chuckle, I love it. Chris Webby, Fire in My Blood, that's his new song. We're gonna have to check that out. It popped up here. 
That last one he did with Rem was really good. We had a really awesome discussion in that last one with Rem, the baggage song. Go check that out if you haven't seen it yet. This was freaking awesome. I really loved this. Very creative, very humorous. A lot of humor inside of here. Laughs, lots of laughs in this video. It's just a really feel-good song about getting yourself into trouble on a Saturday night. And now, you, now you're probably going to be grounded for life, right? <laughs> but the cop, obviously, they went somewhere for adults, though, because the cop already knew that he had a license by seeing him in there with the rest of them, which implies that they needed one to get in, right? So, they just don't want their folks to know who they'd be raging out with on the Saturday nights at this point, you know? Even as adults, they're like, I still don't want my parents to know who I'd be out here raging with and everything, getting myself into trouble. Now he's lost his car, his whole car got towed and everything. Boys ran away. Be like that sometimes. Shit happens, man. <laughs> I love it. The original video will be in the description. As always, subscribe to the artists we have on the channel. Support them. Go show them love. Thank you guys for supporting me on my recovery journey and for tuning in to all the videos, requesting all these awesome songs. We have a really good time on here. It's a blessing to be able to do this for you guys. Go get help if you need it. Live a better life for yourself. Build yourself into a better state, a better mental state, a better physical state. Become more strong as a person. Settle into things that you know are the proper things for your own life journey. And do things to help those that have also been through the same things that you have gone through and survived in your life. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Go check out my new album, Stranger Labyrinth Thicket, that I put out last week. Community posts, first few ones there have links to it. Go check that out for me. I'd appreciate it a lot. This was awesome. We're going to get out of here. I'm Vacasa Kabe. A reaction video a day or two. Keep the doctor away. Fuck those apples. Leave a like for me. Comment those suggestions. Subscribe up this way. Bang that notification bell for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you so much. Thank you for everything. Y'all have a blessed night. Peace.